Hey lovely people welcome to our YouTube channel Astro Tara today we are going to talk about Trump's six card the lovers represents the lovers allegory is of a union of opposites pictured here as male and female and of the mystical bond between those who are alike in spirit description not counting supernatural figures described below some decks show only two young lovers who may be either clothed or nude others show a third person either observing or in some way influencing the outcome of their match in several medieval style decks the third party is an older man he may be either an observer or a parental figure to whom the young couple are evidently explaining themselves in egyptian style decks the trio shows a young man and two young women between whom he obviously has to choose In decks which show three human figures there is a winged cupid style figure leaning out of a cloud above them whose arrow points toward the woman or one of the two young women In decks that show only two young lovers the supernatural influence above them is a winged angel with its hands outspread in blessing the choices necessary for them to make are shown in other imagery for example White's deck depicts an Adam and Eve pair standing before the tree of knowledge and the tree of life, respectively. The necessity of making a choice is as much a part of the allegory behind the scars as the union of two young lovers. Meaning, the lover's allegory is of a union of opposites, pictured here as male and female, and of the mystical bond between those who are alike in spirit. it can refer to romantic love or an ideal friendship or some other close bond between two people especially when there has been some kind of barrier or opposition which the two souls involved must or will overcome in order to join if this is the case then it is mutual commitment that is the essential element which unites those whose lives must run together but there are other kinds of marriage and other kinds of opposites that need to be reconciled As an allegory of your personal spiritual development, the lovers depicts the union of opposites within yourself. Each of us has qualities which we perceive as positive or negative, and traits which are apparently in conflict. And for each of these qualities or traits, there are those which presents we accept and others which we would prefer to eliminate, some, in fact, which we don't even want to admit we have. The lovers asks you to explore and reconcile these opposites within yourself rather than attempting to eliminate or change them. By understanding and utilizing both sides of your own nature, you become a coherent whole, no longer in conflict with yourself. And because this is a difficult task, once again it is commitment which is required of you in order to reach your goals. You are not simply being asked to accept the of these different traits. You are being asked to understand that even the ones you don't approve of are necessary to your continued growth and well-being. Opposite does not mean one is good and one is evil. The opposite traits within yourself or within the other person with whom you are trying to bond are mirrors of each other which complement and can support each other. What needs to be accomplished here is a union of these opposites. a way of making them work together which eliminates their conflicts and creates a whole greater than the sum of its parts the reward for resolving the disparate elements within yourself is an increase in your own strength and will you no longer waste time and energy struggling uselessly to eliminate qualities in yourself or others that disturb you instead you integrate them into yourself and then can use them to further your own control of situations and events In the reading, upright or positive attraction, love, problems or trials overcome by harmony, union, cooperation, wise decisions, the correct choice made perhaps between two equally worthy goals, a possible struggle but with happiness as the outcome. Reversed or negative failure, conflict, division, immature planning, frustration, unrealistic goals, poor choices, unhappiness. As the high priest card suggests that your best road is to develop your own will rather than accept the requirements of others the lovers reminds you that those others either people or forces have characteristics or elements that you need to survive and grow if this card represents the querent 
then you are about to be faced with an important choice that will influence the course of your life from now on. You must decide hopefully wisely what you are going to do. And whatever you choose, you must commit your energies to making it work if you expect to succeed. Thank you so much for watching this video. Do like, comment, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel Astro Tara.